Okay, so I made this Harry Potter blanket and I'm really excited about it. It took me a couple months really pushing myself, a couple hours every night, and I can't wait to give it to who I'm gonna give it to. But the problem is when I crochet, my tension isn't always the best. And when you make a blanket or if you're making um, tiles, like a granny square blanket, they don't, the tiles don't always come out evenly. If you're crocheting from day to day, like your stress level might determine like how tight your stitches are or just how in a hurry you are. You have to really be mindful of that. So unfortunately for me, my, when I started doing this, I started really loose and told myself I was going to stay that way, but I didn't stay the same. So you can see when I fold this in half that <coughs> these ends don't quite line up. So they're quite short. So what I need to do is block the blanket, which means I'm going to have to wet the whole thing down and I'm going to have to stretch it across a frame. Uh, so right now we're working on building the frame for blocking one giant blanket crochet project. So. All right, so we're part way into this project of uh, making this frame to block that blanket. And we took some two by fours and uh, mitered the edges or the ends at 45 degree angles. So we're basically making a frame, uh, kind of like a picture frame out of two by fours. And uh, the way we got the measurements is you measured your blanket, right? The big end? Yes. And then, uh, the length and the width. Oh, we subtracted an inch mm -hmm. from the inside, because two want, inches actually. I want the edges to be right in the middle. I want the nails that I'm gonna hang the blanket on or tack it down with to be right right here in the center of the two by four on the flat side. Yeah, so we did the, the length and width of this and then the inside measurement of these two by fours we took two inches off. That way the blanket would overlap um, an inch all the way around from the inside edge. And then we took a square, we just bought like a, I, I guess it's like a quarter of a sheet of plywood yeah. from the store and we cut it into triangles and we're using those to get our square for each corner. So we got this one done already. This one down here, we just set, and we're using my big square to make sure it's square. And it probably doesn't have to be exactly perfect for something like this, because you got a little room um, on the two by four to wiggle a bit, but we're gonna do that one, and then get this one, and then work our way around to this, and hopefully we'll be all square by the end. These are just roof and nails. Some old roof and nails I had. It's just what we had. Yeah, we just need something that would get through the plywood and bite enough into the the two by four without sticking through the other side. All right, so I'm just gonna start a couple of nails in this. So we have something to tack it down real quick. All right, I'm just starting one nail on each side here so that we can tack it in place. We always square off of the last direction we squared from, so make sure we're good here. And 
Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Our deck's a little uneven, so it's making this fun. Yeah, we should be pretty good if we get that up there. All right, I'm gonna start this one on this side and then check that. to me. See how it still like shifts a little bit? I don't know if you caught that on camera. Yeah. You did? Yeah, I think so. Okay. When it's just got one nail, <coughs> these boards can still flex a little bit, so you got to put some more nails in it offset to keep them in place. All right, we got it all together. You able to move it on your own? I guess so, but this is the long edge. Picked it up wrong. Yeah, it'd probably be easier to do it the other way. I mean, yes, I can move it on my own. It's gonna get heavier when you put that blanket on it. Yes, but I'm probably gonna lean it up against something like the wall. Yeah. Doable? Yeah. Okay, good. Does it seem like it's holding together pretty well? Uh, like it's keeping the, it's not like wobbly? Yeah. I mean, for the most part. Yeah. I'd be worried about it rocking side to side, but nope. It's good. I think we did good. All right.